G'day everyone. The Bramble K. Malomus. Like me, it's blonde, it's adorable. And we both used to live in the land down under. Now, I don't live in Australia anymore because I f***ed off to America. But the Bramble K. Malomus doesn't live in Australia anymore because it's dead. It was just the first mammal to be completely wiped out by climate change. Now, humans have killed off many mammal species before, including the Tasmanian tiger, hunting, the western black rhino, poaching, the vaquita, overfishing, the Yangtze dolphin, pollution, the south china tiger, poaching, the Saudi gazelle, hunting, and the Christmas island shrew, thanks to the introduced yellow crazy ant. And yes, those ants are dead set mental. But the bramble K. Malomus is the first mammal to die out due to climate change. Um. Congrats, Australia. So how exactly did this adorable rat-like Malomus succumb to climate change? Was it that it didn't have adequate access to food, unlike its cousin pizza rat? Nope. Was it that it was basically a rat and so no one gave a rat's ass? Yeah, that's basically it. Scientists and the conservation community knew that the Malomus was critically endangered for a long time. They believed that the last Malomus may have just drowned in a storm surge that, because of rising sea levels caused by climate change, flooded the entire island. But it was only when someone formally declared the Malomus was dead did anyone care that it had ever been alive. It's a common story in history. Just look at Van Gogh, Galileo and the 9-11 hijackers. Now, here's what's frustrating. Experts like Dr. John Wynarski said that the death of the Malomus was entirely foreseeable and preventable. It suffered from living a long way from anywhere else, being a rat and being not particularly attractive. It was not an animal charismatic enough to garner much public attention. So in other words, if you want to be an animal that's not extinct, you better bloody be the Cardi B of the animal kingdom. Now, obviously, Australia is very sad at the loss of one of our own. And so we've totally reformed our climate change policies. And <laughs> just kidding. Australia doesn't give a shit. The Prime Minister, Scott Morrison, got his hands in the pockets of big coal and told Aussie kids on climate strike to get back to school. Diane Feinstein, eat your heart out. Now, I should note here that each Australian summer for the last five years has been way hotter than the previous summer. So in Australia, that's bloody hot. There's also been droughts and bushfires and floods, you name it. And our coral reef has been bleached to high heaven, literally. But this isn't a story just about Australia. Loads of mammal species around the world are at risk because of climate change. Think about this. Could we humans be the next Bramble K. Malomus? Well, that's an exaggeration. Of course we won't be the next mammal species to go extinct, but if we don't get our shit together soon, well, let's just say the endangered species list is not a good place to be. But what do you guys reckon? Are you as outraged as me about the loss of this adorable rodent from our world? Let me know in the comments below. And in honor of the Bramble Key Malomus, I'll now send you off with some photos of this adorable rat in happier times. everyone, I'm Jade Lovell, resident science nerd on the Young Turks Network. You're watching SciQ and we know you don't want to miss an episode, so please click the subscribe button down below.